Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications so you never miss a tutorial. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to write text along curved paths and objects using Affinity Photo. The same method can also be used within Affinity Designer. So, let's dive right in. First, I'll draw a curved path using the pen tool. Then, select the text tool. Normally, we write text on the canvas like this using the text tool. It's in a straight line, no fun, huh? Let's write some text on this curved path. To do this, make sure the path is selected, then select the text tool. Now, move the mouse cursor over to the vector path. You'll notice that the symbol of the text tool changes to a new symbol with the letter T over a squiggly curve. When the symbol changes, left click to write on the curved path. While writing, you can see these two little triangles on the path. Basically, the green triangle is the starting point of our text and the red one is the ending point of our text. We can adjust these two points by dragging them along the path using the mouse like this. What if you want to write on the other side of the curve? No worries. Just click the reverse text path button. This will move the text to the other side of the curve. I always align the text in the middle to balance it between the starting and ending points. Using this baseline slider, we can adjust the distance between the path and the text. Now, let's write text on a circle. The method is similar to writing text on a path. I'll adjust the points so that my text stays on the upper half of the circle. I'll reduce the text size so it fits perfectly and adjust the baseline. Now let's move this text to the inner side of the circle. Next, I'll swap the positions of the starting and ending points because I want the text to be on the lower half of the circle. I'll also add some letter spacing because the text looks clumped together. That looks better. You might notice that while writing text on a path or shape, the path or object disappears. To fix this, you can create a duplicate of the original shape or path. Then write on the duplicate path or object. And that's it for this video. Now you know how to write text along curves and shapes in Affinity Photo. If you found this tutorial useful, please give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and let me know in the comments what you'd like to learn next. Don't forget to subscribe for more graphic design tips and tricks. See you in the next one.